welcome to this episode of Four Low Explorer. I've been on a hiatus lately with the uh, video producing for this YouTube channel. Uh, you know, just living that busy, busy life and working all the time. But uh, today, I'm on my way up to Horseshoe Lake, which is just up north of Bartlett Lake, and Bartlett Lake is uh, normally my spot. Oof, washboards. Bartlett Lake is normally the place I like to go to, but uh, after the bushfire, they have that entire area closed off, because I like to go the back way, the hardcore way off the Beeline Highway. And uh, ever since the bushfire, they've got that closed off until about March 21st next year, I believe, or March 15th, something like that. So, and uh, that's my backyard up there, so now I'm just having to try and check out some new areas. These washboards are god awful at this tire pressure. We gotta lower some air down a little bit. Got about another six miles to go. And, uh, yeah, I can't stand it anymore. My Jeep's about to rattle itself apart. <laughs> Having fun, Trooper? Take that as a yes. No, I know, he's happy as hell to get out of that house. I've been neglecting him lately. Though he was definitely due for one of these trips. Let's, uh, let's drop some air out of these tires. Got my handy dandy boulder tools. Quick deflator. Love this thing. Uh, we're at 35 PSI right now, so uh, I think I'm gonna drop down to about 15 and that'll smooth things out. Not gonna do any hardcore rock crawling or anything like that. Not that I know of anyway. Right now it's just uh, really bad washboards. I can't stand that stuff. So let's, let's get this going here. That's one down, three to go. Oh yeah, that's so much better. I can actually drive at a decent rate of speed. And now I feel like I'm gonna chip a tooth. <laughs> Alright, well, we got about five more miles to go. Really excited to see what this is going to look like.
good spot, but I want to go further. I'm out here to explore, right? That's the end of this trail. Just drop straight down. Looks like I'm gonna have to go back to uh, that, that other little spot over there and make do with that, I guess. I can see a track down there and I'm pretty sure I know how to get to that spot over there. But that means I'd have to backtrack all the way, all the way back to that cattle chute and get back on that main road over there and go all the way around, all those hills and stuff on the other side over here. But I oh mean, that spot doesn't look all that great anyway just dried out marsh I haven't been getting any freaking rain this year didn't even have a monsoon season that's why everything is so dry and this lake is so low but I still see water so that's good enough for me come here, come here. That water's nice and cold, huh? I don't even bring any swim trucks with me or anything. I thought it'd be a little bit too cold, but it's still pretty warm out here. I could seriously jump in there right now just for about, I don't know, a solid 10 seconds or so and get out and then I'd be fine. Water's definitely cold though. It'll get pretty chilly tonight, that's for sure. I think it's gonna get down in the 50s or so. I mean, that's nothing, but still. Cold enough for me. Cold enough for this Arizona boy. And that bush pilot just skinned the lake and I missed it. Hope he comes back. Didn't expect that. Well, hell. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and set up camp over here. I was originally planning on loading up the kayak and going across the lake to the other side over here somewhere and finding a good spot over there to camp. But the water level is so low, I don't even think it's even worth it. It's gonna be that dried out marsh like I saw over there on the other side of this hill. Uh, that's, that's what I wanted to do was go to the mouth of the Verde River and I'm looking at it right now, clear across the other side over here, but I can just see all that dried out marsh. Uh, you know, it's just the water level is so low. But what I am gonna do is still get on the kayak, of course, and do a reconnaissance mission, I guess, if you wanna call it that, survey the area, and uh, probably just find a good spot for next time. Something that looks pretty good. And uh, you know, we'll go ahead and do that on the next one. But uh, yeah. Well, let's get this Jeep unpacked. Come here, Jibber. Come here. Oh, let me get this damn thing off you. Come here. God, oh, this 
place is full of them. Come here, right here. Right here. Sit. Sit. Oh, Jesus. Sit. Sit. Don't move. Oh, these things are a pain in the ass. Finally made camp. All right, well, I think we're gonna get something cooking over here. I haven't eaten all day, I am starving. I know Trooper's hungry too. Turkey sausage links. Get my secret recipe cooking over here. Beef ramen, green onions, two eggs. It's gonna be badass. Hot jambalaya. Oh, easy, easy, easy. Calm down, fucker. And now the eggs. And I fuck that up every time. that there for now. That's a little better. Switcheroo. She had to do this thing. And there you have it. 
Stay tuned for more recipes. Chooper! Trooper, it's dinner time. Come on. He's exploring over there. Come on, ding, 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 ding. Dinner time. Yeah, I tried to keep it out of the dirt for him. All right, it's my turn. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, that's so good. I highly recommend you try it out sometime. Good enough for me. Now for this. <laughs> Man, this thing cusses the water pretty good. Sailing off into the sunset. Wow, look at that cloud formation.
hear the ducks? I love Trooper so much, man. He's like, he's like fun sized. <laughs> he's a perfect size for everything. Let's get that beautiful sunset in the backdrop. Break. Perfect night. Man, the temperature is just right. Nice and warm with a cool draft. I'm going to finish this beer and me and Trevor should probably head back pretty soon because I'm going to lose sight of my uh, my little dock over there by my campsite. <laughs> I'm going to be lost at sea. But it's just too beautiful over here on this lake right now. I don't want to leave. Somebody's way out there. Well, I guess that's a wrap for tonight. I'm gonna get back to camp over here in a minute and do some more filming of this episode of Four Low Explorer tomorrow. Wish you were here. Good night.